When you are down, depressed, and need some loving, find a place to log in and get ready to experience human connection as only the internet can deliver. John Halcyon has created a website where you can connect with love-hungry people like yourself. John talked to us about his site. Who would you say this campaign is really aiming towards? I think that all of us who live in a society that has media, which is all of us, is exposed to constant reminders of how many people out there are angry at us, how much danger there is, how much hatred there is. If we kind of strip away these broad general politics that are out there, there are, the world is populated with people, and people have love in their hearts if you let them. So check your clocks, and if it's 1 p.m. Pacific time on Tuesdays, you can get that love and touch and squeezing you deserve. Well, you know what time it is, don't you? Oh my gosh, I just looked at the clock, it's one o'clock. That means it's time for our Hug Nation hug. Wherever you are, let's take a moment and have a hug. So let's grab ourselves by the shoulders. All this torso tugging began six years ago when John was searching for a way to make the world a more loving and understanding place. His grandfather, a Baptist minister, helped John devise a way to do just that through the power of touch and an organization they named Hug Nation. Now, seven years later, Grandpa is gone, but HugNation.com is going strong, delivering virtual hugs and positive thoughts daily to hundreds of online visitors. What happened there? I think that on a very real level, we are all connected. You know, if you really allow yourself to hug, and both people are really allow themselves to, to feel that connection and go to heart to heart and sink into it for, you know, a second or two longer than the gesture of a hug. I think it can be a really magical connection and, and a bonding experience that can, that can lift a lot that can be heavy on the heart. When virtual hugs just won't do, keep an eye out for a pink winged motorhome. John takes the hug mobile on the road periodically and delivers random hugs for all that are wanting. People say, well, what's the purpose? I go, it's, it's to give us permission to be more loving because so many voices out there discourage us from being more loving. Up next on News to Me, kids driving recklessly, two train routes you won't want to miss, Muppets with guns, and more after the break.